you are going to watch a student answer this question. The student's level for IELTS is a 7-8, Cambridge Proficiency Level. If you want to hear a native speaker answer this same question, go to lclanguages.com or see the link in the description below. Before we listen to this student, please read these questions which you will answer when listening. Russia is a really big country, uh, which is why it is pretty safe to say that the overall air pollution level is not too alarming. However, if we talk about the cities, the situation is a bit different here. Um, in the big cities, especially those that are also tourist attractions, the level of pollution is not too high, mostly because the government prohibits building plants near the cities, especially those plants that emit dangerous and toxic exhaust gases. In the small cities, uh, the level of pollution is also quite low because there are no plants there at all and the traffic is pretty low. However, there are a couple of large industrial cities, especially near the Ural Mountains, where the level of pollution uh, reaches the level at which uh, the smoke amount is really dangerously high. For example, the level of pollution in Chelyabinsk, one of the largest Ural cities, is almost as bad as in the most notorious Chinese cities, with people choking on the smoke when they exit their homes. Uh, it can easily be one of the most dangerous cities to live in because of the air pollution. What is her linguistic choice for the overall situation with pollution in Russia? Is the overall situation with pollution very alarming, alarming, or not too alarming? Russia is a really big country, uh, which is why it is pretty safe to say that the overall air pollution level is not too alarming. What's her linguistic choice to talk about the level of smog or smoke? It's really dangerously high, it's dangerously high, or it's high. However, there are a couple of large industrial cities, especially near the Ural Mountains, where the level of pollution uh, reaches the level at which uh, the smoke amount is really dangerously high. For example, the level of pollution in What's her linguistic choice about the smog or smoke in Chelyabinsk? Does she say that they choke on smog, breathe in smog, or occasionally breathe in smog? For example, the level of pollution in Chelyabinsk, one of the largest Ural cities, is almost as bad as in the most notorious Chinese cities, with people choking on the smoke when they exit their homes. So, what's your linguistic choice for this question? For more material to help you improve your speaking to get an IELTS 7 or 8 or the Cambridge Proficiency Certificate, or improve your speaking for other exams, visit the website lclanguages.com. If you like this video, please like it and subscribe. Take it easy.